Hello, YouTube, it's Garemore with more sound. Today, I made some changes to my Anks Blue Fruit Notifier for iPhones. Before I demo the system, I'm going to show you now of the circuit. There's the microcontroller is still the same. I've replaced the the two LEDs with a single RGB LED. And there's a 1K and a 220 ohm on the red. The 1K is pulling up to the positive supply. Otherwise, without without that, the 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 light will just glow dimly, and the green and the blue are just normal normal wiring. And the buzzer circuit is still the same. Device is turning on now. Yeah, everything else is still the same. I know everybody wants to see this and hear this here we go with a phone call it, it does a rainbow of colors Unfortunately, I cannot get the color pattern to repeat, unfortunately. Got to restart it because it disconnected again. Here's the iMessage test. You can see now the light is green. Over here on my computer it says Garemore one audio message. Shows the same thing on my phone and my watch. Next is the Gmail test. <laughs> Two different Gmails. Want to hit the reply? I am not sure why Gmail shows up as an other alert. It would make more sense to show up as an email. going to send the same thing on my other Gmail account. I'm going to do this quick because I got to relist soon. Here we go. I went to blue. And also, if an other or unknown alert comes in, it will show up with an amber light. It also updated the alert for the scheduler.
we're here for about a minute. On, you can activate. Come on, stupid microcontroller. I gotta relist. Should be activating any moment now. If I did this correctly. Here's my notification history if you you're interested. Go ahead and remove that. And when you remove a message. And when you remove a notification, all the lights go out. Here's that ghosting. trigger this but here's what the battery warning does I, think this, I must have disabled it in the last I must have disabled the low battery warning all the code <laughs> by the way I have a playlist of all of my previous notification device attempts so far this is the only one that I've figured out how to work. And if you want me to do another comparison between this method and the strobe detection method, just let me know. And by the way, Thank you for watching. Remember to like the video, share this video with your friends, and subscribe to my channel. And also support me by buying from my eBay or Mercari stores. Goodbye.